Hello guys and welcome to my body care collection video for July 2024. What a wonderful So as you can see behind me on the bed, I have all of my body care that I own laid out and it's a ton. I'm going to just warn you. I actually think it's smaller than when I last updated you guys in January, but it's definitely still pretty large. <laughs> so I'm going to go through every item with you. All my numbers and my totals are going to be at the bottom of the screen. So let's just hop right in. So if you can't tell, I do have a blanket underneath all my body care because I was not certain that it wouldn't leak onto my white comforter. So we have a navy blue blanket down underneath it. So the perfumes are going to be a little bit hard to see. But besides that, everything else looks totally fine. So here's just a quick overview of everything that I own. Of course, I have a big long line of fine fragrance mist at the top. I've got body creams, shower gels. Oh, sorry. This is a... Uh, Moisturizing body washes, shower gels, body creams, lotions, oils, body scrubs, and then I've got a bunch of minis all at the bottom and perfumes, and then some hand soaps and some hand lotions. So let's get started. I think I'm going to start down at the bottom just because it's the easiest thing for me to reach. So down here, I've got my mini fine fragrance mist, and I do have eight of them right now. I'm not quite sure what I had in January, but I'll put that number down below. And I think we're right about the same as January. I don't think I've finished any of these up. So I have Hot Cocoa and Cream, Happy Halloween Vampire Blood, Champagne Apple and Honey. I have two Midnight Ember Glows. This one is almost finished, but this one is full. I have Cozy Vanilla Bourbon, Warm Vanilla Sugar, and then Pink Bear. These are my mini moisturizers. I have one Scentsy Coconut Daiquiri sample. I have this Sol de Janeiro sample. This is the Beige Flora Elastic Cream. And then I do have a happy birthday. I think this is vanilla buttercream, little mini body cream. Here's all of my perfumes. So here's my full size and then like my minis slash roller balls. So I've got 304 from Pacifica, Sunrise Moon, Neon Moon, Dream Moon, and Island Vanilla, which is in my summer project Use It Up right now. I have two from Dossier. I have Floriental Brown Sugar and Musky Musk. I do have one Bath & Body Works Champagne Toast. And then I have these two mini coffrets from Ariana Grande. And the red one is Sweet Light Candy Special Holiday Edition. And this one is Moonlight. And then I've got my little mini spritzers from Bath & Body Works. I have a Midnight Ember Glow that I've never used. I actually already went through a full size of this one. So I'm keeping that one for the fall. I have Into the Night and Sunshine Mimosa. And then I have this Skylar Vanilla Sky Roller Ball. So I have a bunch of these minis. I'm going to have to pick them up one by one and tell you what they are. But I got a set from Replica uh, during the fall last year. So that's where all these came from. So the first one is Springtime in the Park. Then we have Autumn Vibes, Jazz Club, By the Fireplace, Lazy Sunday Morning, which I'm currently using in my project Use It Up, Under the Lemon Tree. And then I have Glass Rose. I have Tom Ford Ebony Fume. I have Chloe Coco Chanel, Chance by Chanel, and this little mini rollerball from Nest in Madagascar Vanilla. Look how cute, so cute. And then I do have this little three set from L'Occitane. I have two shower oils. One is like a mini you can buy and one came free with purchase. And then I have the skin oil. So these are shower oils and skin oil. Moving up to body scrubs. I have seven body scrubs right now. I think I actually have less than January, which is great. And I'm really close to finishing two of them. So I have these two from the winter time. I have Tree Hut's Candy Cane and then Dove's Holiday Treats Sugar Cookie. This one was super yummy. I have a couple fall ones, actually mostly fall ones. I have cinnamon pumpkin pie also from that Dove Holiday Treats line. This one is so yummy. I have velvet coffee from Tree Hut, which I'm trying to finish up. It's just like crazy strong. It's like a little too strong, honestly. I have this Dionys goat milk whipped body scrub in vanilla bean, which is in my project Use It Up. And then I have two from Bath & Body Works. I have marshmallow pumpkin latte and Together Weather. Next, I have four body oils. So I have one from Pacifica, one from Glossier, which I'm currently finishing up. This one is amazing, you guys, but be careful, it does stain clothes. Uh, Mary Kay's Silkening Dry Oil, and then Bath & Body Works Aromatherapy Stress Relief. I have to say, I think this is a record for how many body lo lotions I own at one time. I only have five. That's kind of crazy for me. So I have Pure Wonder from this past winter, 
white pumpkin and chai, which I'm saving for the fall. And then these three are just kind of year round. I'm using two of them right now. Cotton candy clouds, wild Madagascar vanilla, and meet me in Miami. And then two body butters. I have Bath and Body Works Midnight Amber Glow. This one is pretty full. This is one of my favorite scents of all time, so I had to pick it up in the body butter, and it is glowing. And then I have the Fenty Skin Butter Drop Whipped Oil Body Cream. This came in a little mini set around the holidays. I think I got it around uh, Black Friday. And I already finished off the Cinnamon Vanilla, Cinnamon Dreams and Vanilla ones. And then now I have the just original scent left over. I do really like this formula. And then I've got five hand soaps right here. I just did a hand soap haul recently. I will link it up above, but I refilled my hand soap collection because I was totally out. So I have ice cinnamon rolls that's left over from this past winter. I have Palo Santo and Sage, Sea Salt and Lime, Strawberry Pound Cake, and Pineapple Prosecco. And once again, kind of setting a record here with how little body creams I have. I only have four. I feel like that's really great. I'd like to keep my body cream collection between four and six just because I know that they go bad so quickly. So I have Cozy Vanilla Bourbon and Midnight Amber Glow, which I'm definitely saving for the fall. And then these two I'm currently using in my Project Use It Up Whipped Coconut Milkshake, which is super yummy and gourmand, and Fresh Coconut and Cotton, which I'm really enjoying. I don't usually like fresh scents, but I'm loving this one. I'm gonna move on up to my hand creams. So I do have this full-size Pacifica Vegan Collagen Hand Cream, which you know what, I think I actually might put in our guest bathroom because I feel like that's really nice to have next to the hand soap. I've got these three from Bath & Body Works, Fine Serenity Mimosa and Spearmint, Coffee and Whiskey, and Hot Cocoa and Cream. And then one little mini from L'Occitane. This was a gift with purchase. It's just a little mini dry skin hand cream. And then a Burt's Bees hand cream in a pot. You'll have to forgive the upside down angle for the moisturizing body washes, but I can't reach them any other way. So I've got three moisturizing body washes. We have Pure Wonder, Into the Night, and Midnight Amber Glow. And then I have six body washes, which I think also is kind of a record for me to have this little. So I have one left over from Wintertime, which is I Heart Revolution's Shower Shake in Vegan Mint Chocolate. I have a couple from fall. This is Philosophy's Pumpkin Icing. I'm, I love this scent and I'm really, I've started liking Philosophy's products a lot more. I have Cozy Vanilla Bourbon, which I'm also saving for fall. I have Among the Clouds and then I'm using Beach Nights right now and Pacifica's Island Vanilla. Okay, we're on to the final section and this is really where my collection like flops hard. It's all of my fine fragrance mists. I have so many just because I don't go through these very quickly. So let's start at the top. I have my kind of like year round scents. This is just like traditional body care scents. So we have Pure Wonder, Twinkling Nights, Velvet Sugar, Warm Vanilla Sugar, and Almond Blossom. And then I've got my winter scents. So I have these three from the same line, I believe in like 20, 2020. So we have Christmas Cookies, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Coconut Mint Drop, and then Mint Chocolate Swirl, which came out randomly during SAS, and it was like a Canada exclusive. Well, this is actually just Coconut Mint Drop. They're the same scent. And then I have Frosted Wonderland from like 2014 or something. Um, this is one of my absolute favorites. It's really just a collector's item for me. I don't really count it as my collection, but I do count it for these videos. Um, and these two are sister scents. They're very close. They're not exactly the same though. So Frosted Wonderland is that one right here. And then Wrapped in Vanilla, which is one of my absolute favorites. I'll definitely bring it back for fall, even though it is a winter scent. And then I've got my fall scents. So these two from Halloween, I have Everlasting Magic and Vampire Blood. And then White Pumpkin and Chai, Vanilla Mocha Cafe, otherwise known as Vanilla Mocha Cream, otherwise known as something else. I don't remember what the third one is, but yeah, I love this scent. Bonfire Bash. And then kind of year-round slash spring summer scents, strawberry pound cake, fresh coconut and cotton, and beach nights. I'm using these two right now on my project. And then I also have a couple from different brands. So I have Pink Whipped Dream, Victoria's Secret Nectar Pulse, and this one from Sol de Janeiro 62 Pistachio and Salted Caramel, which is also in my project Use It Up for the Summer. So that is my current body care collection. I feel like I'm doing 
actually pretty good in most categories. I'm doing really good in hand soaps. I'm doing pretty good in body creams, in shower gels, in uh, body lotions, just not really in like minis and um, fine fragrance mists, of course. I'm feeling all right on the body scrubs. I definitely wanna get a few more finished before the fall comes around because I would like to get new body care for the fall. However, I know that I'm keeping a lot from the last couple of years, so I definitely need to kind of get on using my summer scents and finish those up so that way I'm in a really good spot to be able to buy fall body care because it's already coming out and I already want to buy it. So that's everything for my body care collection. I will put my final totals up on the screen of where I'm at now versus earlier in the year. And yeah, that's everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below, how is your collection at right now? Are you collecting? Are you trying to reduce your size? Are you trying to grow your size? Have you just joined the like body care community? Let me know down below and I will talk to you all in my next one. Bye.